Good morning everybody. Can you help me with the rhyme? It's story time. It's story time. Shh, listen. What's the story today? Peace at Last by Jill Murphy. Jill Murphy is the name of the author. The author is the person that writes the story. Oh, what can you see children? Meow. Peace at last. The hour was late. Mr. Bear was tired, Mrs. Bear was tired, and Baby Bear was tired. So they all went to bed. Look at Mummy Bear doing a big yawn. Ooh. Mrs. Bear fell asleep. Mr. Bear didn't. Oh dear. Mrs. Bear began to snore. <sighs> when Mrs. Bear, can you all help me do a really big snore, children? Are you ready? <sighs> oh no, said Mr. Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went to sleep in Baby Bear's room. Baby Bear was not asleep either. He was lying in bed pretending to be an aeroplane. Can you all help me to be an aeroplane, everybody? Meow, meow, went Baby Bear. Everybody quick, meow, meow, meow. Oh no, said Mr. Bear. I can't stand this. Can you all help me say those words? I can't stand this. One more time. I can't stand this. So he got up and went to sleep in the living room. Tick tock, tick tock went the living room clock. Tick tock, tick tock, cuckoo, cuckoo. Oh no, said Mr. Bear. Everybody, I can't stand this. So he went off to sleep in the kitchen. Drip, 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 went the leaky kitchen tap. Hmm, went the refrigerator. Oh no, said Mr. Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went to sleep in the garden. Well, you would not believe what noises there are in the garden at night. Can you all help me do an owl sound? Twit doo, twit doo, went the owl. Snuffle, 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 went the hedgehog. Meow, meow, sang the cats on the wall. Everybody, oh no, said Mr. Bear. I can't stand this. So he went off to sleep in the car. It was cold in the car and uncomfortable. But Mr. Bear was so tired that he didn't notice. He was just falling asleep when all the birds started to sing and the sun peeped in at the window. Tweet, tweet, went the birds. Shine, shine, went the sun. Oh no, said Mr. Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went back in the house. In the house, Baby Bear was fast asleep and Mrs. Bear had turned over and wasn't snoring anymore. Mr. Bear got into bed, closed his eyes. Oh, peace at last, he said to himself. Burr, went the alarm clock. Burr. Mrs. Bear sat up rubbed her eyes. Good morning dear, she said. Did you sleep well? Not very well dear. Lord baby bear. Oh, never mind, says Mrs. Bear. I'll make you a nice cup of tea. And she did. And there's baby bear bringing the letters to daddy bear. And look how tired daddy bear is. And there's mummy bear with a nice cup of tea. Now, I have a question for you children. On this bed is a book. And if I turn the book over for you to see, the book has got a girl with blonde hair and three bears. And in this story, there is three bowls of porridge, three chairs and three beds. And a girl that goes into a bear's house. Do you know what the story is that, that's on bear's bed? Can you tell Miss Fran? 
Okay. Thank you everybody for listening to Peace at Last. I hope you have a magical day. Bye-bye.